Hello everyone, welcome back to another daily Minecraft video. Today, we're going to be showing you how to get the Journey Map mod for Minecraft 1.21.3. Take it away. Yeah, thank you. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to download and install the Journey Map mod for Minecraft 1.21.3. So, to begin, what you have to do is go to your web browser because we want to download two things. Three things. <laughs> yeah, thank you. So in this video, I'm gonna indeed show you how to get the journey map mod for Minecraft 1.21.3. So to begin, what you need to get is three things. First of all, the fabric installer. Second of all, you need to get the fabric API. And lastly, you need the journey map mod. So to begin, let us open up our web browser to start downloading these different files. Here I have Chrome, and what I'm gonna do is download Journey Map first. So what you need to do is just go in the description because it'll be the link for the mod, or just look it up on Google as well, that works as well. Just look up Journey Map and Minecraft. There you go. So here we have the mod that we want. So just click on journey map and you will have this page. And with this page, all you want to do is go on the versions tab right here and you'll find a lot of different versions. All you want to do is find two things. First of all, 1.21.3 and second of all, fabric. Here we can see that this one has both of them, so it will work. All we have to do is click download by here. Now, you also need the fabric API for this one. Sometimes it says by here what dependencies it has. It doesn't say it here, but you need to have the fabric API to be able to run journey map on your Minecraft. To do so, just go in the other tab or in the description, we will have the fabric API Minecraft. Here we have fabric API. It's a bit of the same thing as the journey map mod. All we want to do is go to the versions right here and we want to look for two things, 1.21.3 and fabric. So as we have both of these by here, all we need to do is download. Now we need fabric and to get fabric, it's something a bit different. Again, the links will be in the description, but it's a, basically a website. You just need to look up fabric Minecraft. And here we have fabricmc.net. This is how we will be able to run journey map on our computer. To do so, just click so on the link and here you will have the website and the blue download button. Just click there and go on Windows right here. So download for Windows, click that. And you will have Fabric Installer, Fabric API, Journey Map. Now we are done with the actual browser so we can close this and go to the next step. That being going to your file explorer to execute the fabric installer. To do so, simply go to your file explorer, then your downloads folder, and finally, fabric installer right here. What we want to do is simply double click the application, and you will have a little pop up Minecraft version 1.21.3, and this is the launcher location. This is just the classic launcher. If you have a different one for Minecraft, make sure it's the same one for your Minecraft. But if you didn't change anything, this should be just fine. Just make sure it's the latest update and click install. There you go. Once it says successfully installed, we can close all that and go to the third step, which is opening the Minecraft launcher. The Minecraft launcher being this app right here. Let's just wait for the launcher to turn on real quick.
Okay, as we just downloaded Fabric Loader, we will have it showing up as the first thing here, but we don't want to click play just yet. What we need to do is go to installations because we need to set the mod into the Minecraft game itself. To do so, simply go to installations and go to the little file icon here. All these work. So just click on any one of these and you will be sent to the roaming.minecraft folder. With this folder, you will have a mods folder as we have fabric installed that is added by fabric. And once we're here, just do the, these little steps. It's quite easy. Go to your downloads folder. Just select both of these, then copy them. And then go to the top left where you have little arrow that says back to mods. Also, you can say just back to previous folder. It's just an arrow that brings you back to the previous folder, which is pretty useful. So just click there and click paste. And there you go. We have Fabric API and Journey Map Fabric for 1.1.3 onto our mods folder. Once done, just open up Minecraft again. Go on play. Make sure this is the fabric loader you have selected and click play. Okay, once Minecraft is opened, here we can see Minecraft 1.21.3 Fabric modded. That means Fabric is currently installed. What we want to do is go to a world to make sure the world and the mod works together. So all we need to do is go to a world and we should have a little map. Here it is. We can see little map here says to press J and then we have all of that just a little surprise, you know, like this is the journey map staff, new updates, pretty useful. It's, you know, you can go here, up, settings, that it, you can go really advanced with this stuff, but like you can also go here to the page, you can do a lot of things. It's just, this is just journey mod, mod map, which actually works. Pretty useful. Up here it is. This is every single. You can really change a lot in this. And of course, the little developers here. So here we have this page, which obviously is my loaded chunks. And the blue thing here is the player. Here we can see different mobs and animals. And these are different cars, food, if they're hostile or not. What we want to do here is simply. Yep, close that and load in sub chunks. So if I press J again, we will see that this is a different shape because more chunks are being loaded in. So if I go a bit quickly, you know, we just take, I don't know, a elytra up. And also I like the bundles, by the way, um, elytra and get on the fireworks. There you go. We will start loading in a lot. Fast uh, up and there you go. So once we're here, we press J again, and here we can see that we traveled all the way into here. Position is marked here. We can use left click to move around, right click to teleport here. What not? We got teleported. That works because I am opt. If you're not opt, obviously you won't be able to teleport. Um, but yeah, so that is journey map mod. Now there's a lot more to it, but overall, this is how you download, you know, journey map mod for Minecraft 1.21.3. So yeah, thanks for watching and see you for the next one. Bye.